Well, right on top of 10 a.m., news coming in. The case of the attack on Times Now's crew is now all set to be raised in the Uttar Pradesh Assembly today by the BJP. The party will be demanding a debate on the worsening law and order situation and the mob-like mentality that has set in in the political class of the state of Uttar Pradesh. Pranshu is on the phone line with me. Pranshu, give us more details about this. We understand that the BJP will be raising it in the state assembly. Ah uh, yes, that's right. In fact, BJP has made it very clear that uh, it will be raising this issue of attack on Times Now crew yesterday in Shamli. In fact, uh, a notice has already been uh, been given to the Speaker of the Assembly uh, under Rule 311, in which uh, the party will uh, has demanded that the entire the the uh, I mean official proceedings should be suspended, the line up proceedings should be suspended, and this case of attack on media and in general the the, the worsening law and order situation situation in the state that should be debated immediately. So clearly, it, it will be a tough time or. or, or or a tough day uh, for a Khalesh government in the House and also not only the BJP, which has, of course, uh, I mean, given a notice under Rule 311, uh, BSP and the Congress. In fact, the, the, some of the Congress MLAs to whom we have been talking, they say that the party, Congress party, is also going to raise this issue. Uh, BSP has yesterday itself promised that it, it will raise this entire issue in the House today. So, it's, uh, so what, the, the, what seems like is that not only the BJP, but also the BSP, Congress, and other opposition parties are going to raise this issue of attack on the Times Now crew and in general law and order situation of the state in the UP Assembly and clearly if the entire opposition would be raising these issues it will not be easy for the government to defend itself. Absolutely and uh, the Samajwadi party government does stand cornered in this issue uh, you know what are you learning on how the state is now going to battle this any arrests made what's happening? Well, see, uh, the, the, as far as the, the, this, uh, this case of celebratory firing was concerned, three people were detained yesterday. A FIA was filed against five people. Uh, Times Now team has already filed an FIA in which uh, the uh, SPMLA from Kerala, he has been named. Authorities say that they have received this FIA. Uh, and it has been filed under stringent section. So far, uh, there has been no, I mean, arrest on, uh, on, on the FIR which has been filed by us at the Kerala police station against the SPMLA and 25 of his unnamed, unidentified supporters. So clearly, investigation in that case is going on. Government's logic so far is that initially uh, the actual action has been taken in the in forms of suspension and transfers. Uh, but the, the clear question, or the bigger question, is that how far the independent probe would, would take place as far as the, the Times Now's uh, FIR is concerned, and whether some action, concrete action, legal action, would be taken against SPMLA Nahida Nah So clearly, those are the questions which uh, the, the opposition parties would be raising in the House. They would be okay. asked the government to make a make a statement as far as the entire family incident was concerned and other related issues are concerned. Uh, we'll have to wait and see that what sort of response from the government comes in, but probably government will try to pacify the opposition by by uh, by recounting or putting forward the, the steps it has taken so far in the form of suspensions or issuing notice to the to the party uh, MLA. But clearly, uh, the opposition uh, would not be satisfied with such uh, with such defense. All right.